Hello all my lost girlfriends, my name is Forge and welcome back to a brand new video. So today I got something really awesome for you guys. Have you ever wanted to return to your first version of Windows 10 Edition? Well, great news. I found a really cool little application which allows you to do exactly that. It allows you to go through different versions of Minecraft Windows 10 Edition. And now this is created by MC Mr. Arm and I will have a link down below so you guys can download this. And so you can go ahead and go back to your first ever version or perhaps your favorite version of Minecraft Windows 10 Edition. Uh, but I'm just going to go ahead and close out of here and show you guys on how you can do this. So as you can see, we got ourselves the MC Launcher and we got ourselves the Zip. So you're going to need to extract this in order for it to get the folder, obviously. Um, but this is what you're going to get when you first download it. And whenever you go ahead and go to the file, you're not going to have access to all these different files. You're only going to have access to the .exe and as well as the .dlls and those are the only three things that you have access to all these will be downloaded as you go ahead and start installing these different versions and but i want to let you guys know make sure that you always keep a backup of your saves and your add-ons because this is going to replace your current version of minecraft that you have so let's say you're playing all the way in 0.12 it's going to replace that version or you're playing in 1.11 it's going to replace that version and so on and so forth um, but anyway, I'm just going to go ahead and close out of here. Oh, and also make sure that you go ahead and right click on here and run this as an administrator. So that way everything works right. Um, but before you open up the program, there's one more step that you need to go ahead and take. And you're going to need to open up your Windows settings, go down to update security, and go down to uh, all the way down here for developers, and then go ahead and select developer mode. Now, whenever you go ahead and select developer mode, it is going to go ahead and give you a prompt. Are you sure you want to go ahead and do this? and just go ahead and click on yes and then go ahead and enable that um, but once you got that enabled now you're ready to open up the application so yet again go ahead and right click on there open it up in administrator and this is going to be the program that you have in front of you so look at this this is all the versions that we have i've already installed three of these and you're going to be able to go ahead and just play these just like you would with the minecraft launcher for java edition but if you want to go ahead and download these just click on download all right, and that's how it's going to work. But one, what I've actually noticed is that some actually won't work. Like if I were to go and click on 0 0.13, it may look like it's going to install, but then it says download failed. So I'm not sure what's up with that one. I could never get these to work. Same thing for that one. Of course, these were the redstone updates. In case you guys did not know uh, where we got ourselves redstone for the first time. And then Pistons came out later on. Um, but the version I'm going to go for is going to be the 0.14.1 now if it does not show up for you like if it doesn't launch go ahead and just go to your windows search bar and just go and search up minecraft windows 10 and you should be able to find that just fine uh, but for the most part it is going to work flawlessly it is going to allow you to open up your version of minecraft as you guys can see right there we clicked on launch and we're now at 0.14.0 this is just incredible to me and he is i believe that the creator is going to keep on updating this as long as there is updates for this version of Minecraft, at least I'm hoping that he'll keep on updating it because it does seem like he is releasing a new beta, stuff like that, which is pretty great. But yeah, a lot of you guys might think that this is taking Minecraft for free. This isn't, okay? Because you have to buy Windows 10 Edition first. It replaces the Windows 10 Edition that you're using. So in reality, it's not really taking anything for free. It's not really stealing, okay? That's not what that is, okay? Stealing would be taking the Minecraft without permission and not having it downloaded in the first place. That would be what that is. But anyway, now besides that, guys, please let me know of what you think of this down below in the comments and let me know on when you start playing Minecraft Windows 10 Edition. And if you guys enjoyed this video, then let me know by leaving a like on it and subscribe for more videos in the future. And for now, hope you have a logical day and I'll catch you guys next time. Bye!